Vanessa confirm his position. Is he at the lab now? Confirmed. He used an uncharted smuggling path via Turkey, landed on a clandestine airstrip with a chartered jet. Our satellite picked up his heat signature. And he's after this new virus? Affirmative. It's the brainchild of Michael Redensky, a rogue Russian virologist. Hayes is hellbent on acquiring it. What's the virus effect? Our intel suggests it induces a zombie-like state, aggressive behavior, severe neurological degradation. Victims, they're like something out of a horror movie. Got it. And Redensky's lab, is it at the coordinates you sent? Exactly. He's got the lab's blueprint in his suitcase, pressed a digital backup in his and clicked the phone. We hacked into both. The coordinates are a match. Entering with a local patrol unit. We'll move under the guise of a routine sweep. Be careful, Shivel. The opposition's heavy in that sector. And remember, your cover as a Ukrainian soldier is critical. Boston ATU can't be compromised. <laughs> Trust me, Vanessa. In this uniform, I'm just another soldier on the field. Mm hmm your backs. This place could be crawling with zombies. As you can see, they're all in here. The perfect test subjects for our experiment. Great! Are they all infected? Yes. COVID-19 as you requested. But not just any strain. This one is genetically modified to be more contagious and lethal. Perfect. I need to take some samples, and some life ones too. How will that help our cause? Do you mean with the ongoing war in Ukraine? Why else would you be here with us near the battlefield? 
I'm not here for your war. I'm here for a bigger mission. I'm going to use this virus to create chaos and panic in the world. They stole the election, and I have orders to take it back. And how will that affect my troops? They will be slaughtered by the Ukrainian army. Don't worry about your troops. When Trump takes back the presidency, he's going to make sure that all American support for Ukraine stops. He's going to reward you for your loyalty. Good. I can't wait for that to happen. The House has already blocked a $50 billion package for Ukraine. They're losing their allies and resources fast. Yes, I know. Soon the Ukrainian army will have to surrender or die. Paul Hart.